Question 16. Isabella saved 2 coins in her piggy bank each day. Each coin was either a 20 cent or a 50 cent coin. Her father also helped by putting a $1 coin in her piggy bank every 7 days. The total amount of money in the piggy bank after 196 days was $137.90. Part A, how many coins were there in the piggy bank altogether? Okay, let's do part A first. Uh, we're gonna find out how many coins did the father put in. So, okay, the father put in a, a $1 coin every 7 days, right? So we're gonna use 196 divided by 7. Okay, 28. This is the number of $1 coin. Okay, and um, Isabel saved 2 coins every day. So which means that in 196 days, she is going to put in... ...392 coins. Um, Isabella coins. So to find the total, I will just need to add them together. Okay, that's a total of 420 coins. This is the answer for part A. Part B, how many of the coins were 20 cents? Okay, for part B, first we need to find out what is the total amount of the 20 cents and 50 cents coins. So I'm going to use $137.90, subtract away the $28 that was put in by her father. Okay, it will be $109.90. Okay, so now in this case, I know that um, nine, uh, sorry, 392 coins is the total number of coins that Isabella put into the piggy bank. Okay, so I'm going to use the supposition method, which <clears throat> I'm going to assume all of them are 20 cent coins. So 392 times 20 cents is going to give me $78.40 Now I'm going to use a hundred and nine and ninety cents <clears throat> minus $78.40 is going to give me 0.9 minus 78.4 okay <clears throat> 30 one $1.50 the last step would be to use uh, $31.50 divided by 0. Point, the difference which is uh, 0. 0.3 Okay, it's going to give me a uh, 105 But this 105 I believe is the number of 50 cent coins Okay, but usually uh, for supposition questions and guess and check questions, I'll do a final check to make sure that Okay, I get it correct. 50 cents, 20 cents If there's 105, I'll multiply by 0 0.5 If there's uh, 105 50 cent coins, that means I'm going to use uh, 392 minus 105 That means there's going to be 200 and 87 20 cent coins okay i'm gonna multiply it by 20 cents and i'm gonna add them together okay to check for the total okay it gives me 109 dollars and 90 cents okay which is the same as uh the amount over here 
Okay, so for the, the answer for part B will be 287 20 cent coins. Four hundred and twenty and uh two hundred and eighty-seven.